Okay, here we've got an integral, it's a trigonometric integral. It's, a, it's an odd power of cos. And generally when we have odd powers of sine or cos, we try and uh, we take the even part of it and we try and use our um, Pythagorean identity, sine squared x plus cos squared x equals one. So I'm going to separate out the cos squared x And in the place of cos squared x, I'm going to write 1 minus sine squared x. Now I'm going to expand that, take a bit more room. Okay, so here we've got an easy integral to do. That's just going to be sine x. And over here, we've got an integral that's quite similar to the last one we did. And the last one we did, we had a, a squared term and the derivative uh, was, um, was in there as well. So the derivative of sine x is cos x. And so with a, with a substitution, if we say, if we let u equal sine x, then the sine squared will just be u squared. Uh, du will be cos x dx. And so that'll become a really nice, easy integral. Just, it'll, it'll just be u squared du, which will give us u cubed on 3. Easy to do. So I'm going to do that in one step. Uh, so this bit here is going to be just sine x. And then minus. Uh, and, um, and so this becomes the integral of um, u squared du, where... And so finishing that up, which equals, and we're done.